It's a sad day for Sacramento. There's a long line of sad customers waiting to make their final order at Zelda's Pizza. You know, I'll tear up because this is a legend. You know? <laughs> the 47 year old restaurant announced Saturday this would be the last time their doors will open. More than it just being family being lost, it's the pizza is just, there's nothing else like it. We have so many unique, one of a kind things in Sacramento that are just vanishing really quickly, and this is another one of them. I don't understand why it's closing. Yeah. I, I, it's always been so popular. Kind of a very sad day today. But. Owner and son of Zelda, Carrie Matthews says they tried their best to stay in business. <laughs> Just earlier this month, they made the call to close their dining room, cut down on staff, and only take to go orders to pay off bills and hopefully return to full service. This is a slow season of year for us and we just didn't have enough business. On top of rising costs and breaking equipment, Matthew says it was an accident with a customer's credit card and an old system that put them so far under. He paid for his pizza and the terminal froze on his card. So it was like basically eight days, all of our to-go pizzas, everything that was run through that terminal was like open tab on his credit card for eight days. It was almost 15,000 bucks. He says after paying the bank, losing eight days of sales and all kinds of fees, that error cost close to $30,000. It's kind of hard to recover from that when you're barely doing enough to keep the doors open. Now, as the doors close for the last time, Matthew says he's appreciative for all the customers who have come through them for the last four decades. Thank you for your service and everything. In Sacramento, Peyton Headley, KCRA 3 News. Yeah, a lot of customers will for sure miss that place. As for what's next, the owner says he's not sure whether or not he'll sell the restaurant. He's still trying to process how quickly this all happened.